when we put those in the hive, then these girls work really hard to turn it into this stuff. Okay. And what we've got here is, my goodness, we've got a lot of interesting bees going on. What we've got here is these are all baby bees waiting to be born right here. All of these caps right here are baby bees waiting to be born. And these are all the nurse bees taking care of them right here. These little protrusions right here are queen cells. This hive has obviously had a swarm at some point in time and replaced their queen. And here are more bees on this side. And again, baby bees everywhere. I can actually expect to see my queen around here somewhere. These are capped queen cells. Look at that. My, my, my. That means this hive is getting ready to swarm. These are future queens right here in these cells. Here are baby bees down at the bottoms of these. I don't know how well you can see them, but they are in there. So I don't want to disturb those queen cells. We have some pictures for later that they can look at. Right. Okay, so I wasn't really expecting to find that in here this morning. Let's take another look. And as you can see, I'm working these bees in a t-shirt. They're not stinging me. I'm not running away. These are very calm bees, okay? They're used to being taken care of. These honeybees have been taken care of for a millennia, which means it's going all the way back to the time of the pharaohs where they have pictures on the walls of the tombs of beekeepers. People have been taking care of these little honeybees forever. Here's a baby bee right there. There she goes. Yep, right here. We got some baby bees trying to get out. Right about here. Pick her up and put her back. Yeah, I'll pick her up and put her back. Look, I'll pick this bee up and put her back in there. Okay, so. And as you can see, we can pick them up. Um, you get used to it. And again, let me show you some more bees. So I thought I was going to add a box to this, but I'm actually not going to. And it's really hot out here. And a lot of the bees are out working right now. So they're out in the field. They're over in my garden right there, which is just beyond us. If you can see right out there is our vegetable garden. And every plant that these bees like, they love cucumbers. And right now we have got a lot of cucumbers, so they've added one third to my cucumbers. If I didn't have these honeybees here, I'd have one third less cucumbers. That's one third less pickles for us. So, okay. Now, because, uh, look, you see these girls? Look at this. So it's hot out here. You can see they moved into the shade, but, and they're not happy, okay? So, wife is running. I'd love to be able to, to do a little more. You can see these girls. So what they're doing here is they were trying to get out of the sun as I took the lid off and they're all going to ball up. And now I need to try and get as many of these little bees back into their box without hurting them as possible. Can you see that? So what I'm going to do is I'm going to set that crooked a little bit. I'm going to take my smoker and I'm going to see if I can convince them to move a little bit. And you see just a little bit of smoke and they'll move off that edge for me. And we're going to try and do this without any casualties. Me or them. Okay. So. Back in there, please. Back in there, please. Come on, go in the box. All right. You guys too, everybody back in the box. Back in the box, back in the box. Okay, now, unfortunately I left a bunch down here. Uh, you guys can't see this, but where I had the lid setting, I left a whole bunch of bees. So now I'm gonna pick them up with my brush and try and convince them but they should go back in that box. You see that everything I'm doing here is very fluid. I'm not jerking around. I'm not afraid of them. They know that. If you get afraid of these bees, they're going to know it. 
Don't come out here in a bad mood. Okay. Most of the rest of these little bees can figure out how to get into their box. And whew, I'm telling you guys, I'm about to faint. It is very warm right here. It's got to be 100 degrees, and I've got this bee hat on. So now that you've closed up the box? Yes. I'm going to move to the house. Now that you've closed up the box, go ahead and move the computer and yourself back into the air conditioning. Yes, so that's, that's exactly what I'm going to do, honey. I'll, I'm, I'm going to move to the air conditioning. Okay. Whew. Okay. Let me leave this here till later. I can retrieve all this stuff. So during later. this little 